we take upon us the name of Christ and enter into the covenant with God that we will be obedient unto the end of our lives. Each Sunday we renew that baptismal covenant by partaking of the sacrament and witnessing that we are willing to keep the commandments. We seek forgiveness for any thoughts, feelings, or actions that are not in harmony for their Heavenly Father's will. As we repent by turning away from disobedience and by beginning to obey again, we show our love for Him. As we live the gospel, we progress in our understanding of obedience. At times we may be tempted to practice what I call natural man's obedience, in which we disobediently reject God's law in favor of our wisdom or our desires or even popularity. Because this is widely practiced by so many, this perversion of obedience diminishes God's standards in our culture and in our laws. At times, members may participate in selective obedience, claiming to love God and honoring God while picking and choosing which of his commandments and teachings and the teachings and counsels of his prophets, we will fully follow. Some obey selectively because they cannot perceive all the reasons for a commandment. Just as children do not always understand the reasons for their parents, counsel, and rules. But we always know the reason we follow the prophets 